In earlier lessons, you learned how to use the VEX motors as outputs to move the robot, and feedback from sensors as inputs to enable the robot's decision-making capability. In this lesson, you will learn about a device that serves as both an output and an input, the VEX LCD. The VEX LCD allows you to output text on a 2 by 16 character grid. This means that there are two rows of 16 spaces, each of which can be used to display a single character. A letter, number, punctuation mark, or other symbol. This is extremely useful for outputting messages or sensor values at different key points in your program. The LCD also contains three buttons which serve as the inputs. These are also very helpful, as they allow you to do things like control when certain sections of your program are run, or even create a basic menu on the robot. Since the LCD is both an output and an input device, it needs to be able to both send and receive information with the VEX Cortex. This is possible through the UART ports on the VEX Cortex. UART is short for Universal Asynchronous Receiver Transmitter and allows for the serial two-way communication required by the LCD. In Robot C, UART port 2 is reserved for the LCD screen, so no extra configuration steps are needed other than plugging it in. In fact, Robot C will even display the name of your current program as it runs, with no coding on your part. To connect the VEX LCD, you will need a serial Y cable. First, plug the 4-pin end of the LCD into UART port 2. Next, plug the 3-pin end with a yellow wire into the RX, or receive port, of the LCD. And finally, plug the other 3-pin end with a white wire in the TX, or transmit port, of the LCD. If the LCD is properly connected when you turn it on, it will display the name of the program you last downloaded to the Cortex. If the LCD is not properly connected, you will probably see a series of zeros on the screen. In this case, simply swap the wires plugged into the RX port with the wires plugged into the TX port. In this lesson, you learn that the VEX LCD allows you to output text and to accept button input enabling you to create both useful and sophisticated robot behaviors in your programs. Move on to the next video to learn how to display your own messages on the screen.